Angola ups pressure on Africa's richest woman in whereabouts unknown. As the rest of the world focuses on recovering from coronavirus, Africa's richest woman is still intent on recovering assets seized following damning allegations that she embezzled millions, if not billions, from her own impoverished country. Isabel dos Santos returned to the press this week this time calling for the corruption case against her to be dropped on the basis that Angolan authorities used forged documents to get courts to seize her wealth. M's Dos Santos has repeatedly denied all the allegations against her, and husband Syndicat Okolo, among other business partners, claiming they are politically motivated. But Angola has hit back, saying the forged documents which even apparently included a passport signed by the legendary kung fu icon Bruce Lee, had very little to do with the order for asset seizure. Indeed, the country now appears to have increased its demands for restitution from the original 1 billion euros to 4.6 billion euros. Part of M's Dos Santos strategy appears to have been to show illegalities at work in the prosecution against her in order to persuade Portugal, for example, to reverse its own seizure of her business's empire here. So far, it doesn't appear to have worked, stress reports. No one can be sure where Ms. Dos Santos and her husband are these days. Angola meantime has intimated that it will be issuing an arrest warrant if Ms. Dos Santos fails to appear to cooperate with the investigation set off by the Luanda Leaks dossier, and supported by Angolan investigative journalists.